what about google drive or email this small free apps lets you send any file to anyone super fast and secure no account no upload just drag send and it's done it's called auth send me and it works on all platforms like windows mac os and it's private encrypted and it's completely free and open source in this video i'll show you how to get it set it up and test how fast it really is what it started is super easy you just have to head to this official repo and just click on the release and here they are pretty all the operating systems here and i will just click on window.msi file because i'm on windows and download it once you have it you can just open it up and installation setup is pretty easy you just have to click on next and here it's going to show you the location it's going to install the application just click on next and click on install to start the installation once done you are going to be greeted with this plain and simple application and it's pretty easy you just have the send tab and the receive tab over here and to send a file you just have to choose the file you want to send and with this you can just click on the browse file over here and select the file or choose a full folder and share it and it's pretty easy so i'm just going to select any file from my wallpaper folder over here and here we are good to go the last thing you have to do is to just click on start sharing over here which is going to create a ticket for you with this long token so i'll just click on copy and with this anyone who gets the token can just head to the receive tab and over here you have the path which the file is going to be saved to so you can just click on browse and select any folder you want to keep the file so i'll just click on the test folder over here and click on select folder and here i'll just paste in the ticket and here click on download and that's pretty fast i have the file now and now i can just access my folder which i wanted to keep the file inside and the file will be in there and this is pretty fast and smooth and with this the receiver is also going to see if the, the file has been shared completely and this is pretty nice and professional but there is a caveat to be able to receive the file the sender must be online and also active to share the file in the app and if there's a close glitch or if there's a system failure or something everything is going to be breaking and the receiver won't be able to receive the file anymore so this is it for this application and it's pretty straightforward and easy to use and if you really like this browser which i used in this video which is clean and professional then check out this video